Hi guys, in this tutorial we're going to learn how to use booleans to create an object and then uh, split them apart using boolean intersection to kind of compile and decompose for a exploded axon using different splits. So let's start out with just making a few objects here. I'm going to go random but you guys should be evolving your model currently. Um, so let's just take these guys put in some rotation and let's boolean union these guys next I'm just gonna rotate give some variation to this a little teeny bit and shrink it up okay I'm gonna boolean union these guys okay so now that we have a singular poly surface what I'm gonna do next is try to decompose it a little bit but this is random so basically I want to cut this model into parts using other objects. It's kind of a form of just trimming and cutting apart this model. So I'm just using cubes for this, but you could use spheres, um, you could use planes, as long as it has a little bit of surface. We'll just do two for now. So first, we're going to go over to the booleans again, come over to boolean split, and we're going to select the poly surface first, press enter, and then select our cutting objects. And then we're going to delete our cutting objects, and this is what we're left with. Pieces that come apart through that split, and they're actually mitered just about perfectly to it. Next, let's go over a boolean plane here. So I'm just going to select some geometry off of an angle and then expand upon it so it goes across the model. I'm going to take those curves that I just made, join them, and then I'm going to pick them up, extrude them down. Now I'm going to offset this surface. Since this, these arrows are flipping the opposite way in which one I want it to go. And then I'm going to give it some distance, hitting D, and I'm just going to do it randomly. Make sure it's on solid, and create that split. I'm going to move it away from this face here because booleans are pretty tricky with this. And then I'm going to select my poly surface, right click on intersection, hit my cutting object, press enter. Now I'm going to take that away, and we're stuck with this cut plane here and this object here. And now next for setting up an axon typically what I like to do is copy everything that I'm gonna take apart but first let's make some layers and since they have the default layers on I'm just gonna start selecting and changing all my objects here and whatever I have left is the last layer. So everything's on layers now. Now I'm going to copy this and then I'm going to paste it and then I'm going to type in lock or control L to lock one object into place so we know I have a reference point. And then due to the geometry I have I'm going to start pulling this apart. So basically if I hit M enter I can select a little vertice if you have your O snaps on. And I'm going to select here, hit it on the corner here and hit tab and that's going to drag that object out. This is our locked object underneath so we have some reference. I'm going to do the same for the next piece. I'm going to do the same for this piece, hitting tab to pull it out orthogonal. This piece since it's going at an angle I'm going to try something different pull it out this way. And this piece, let's pull it out at another angle, the opposite direction. There we go. These pieces are overlapping, so what I'm going to do again is just pull them out. And that's it.